good John he looked at one day and hung his head in sorrow. There wasn't any snow about and none forecast tomorrow. Cried the sun the sun that day, though it should be freezing. He said it shouldn't be this way, we bag it up the sea. <laughs> it was uh, one of the more um, uh, colourful table talks I've had in a while. Sarah Meads, Oxfam Senior Policy Advisor, how are you? I'm well, thanks very much for having us on the show. Uh, look, thanks for coming on. Now, you've often, Oxfam often have messages, uh, don't buy presents, buy goats for Christmas, uh, teach a man to fish, don't give him fish, that sort of thing. What's your, uh, your, your key points around Copenhagen? Well, obviously at Copenhagen, climate negotiations are a really critical point at the moment. We've got heads of state arriving right now and they need to be sealing a fair, ambitious and legally binding deal. We all know that the world's poorest are suffering the most now and they didn't create the problem. The Coffee and Arms Climate Organisation have predicted that 300,000 people are dying currently annually from climate change impact. That is 821 people daily, 821 currently. If we stay in this current situation, the world is not going to be a good place for our country and for others. Our neighbours in the Pacific need flood protection now. They need to have crops that are resistant to droughts and they need that now. And what is our New Zealand government giving to us? Coal. What have you got going on here? We've got a little Christmas ditty for John Key. Take it away. John Key. 